Mature is here. There is mature games in this one. Yo? <laughs> hey, you guys are gonna have to let me know the volume. I'll adjust it if... If I have to, if it's too loud. It looks like it might be a little loud. <laughs> Monster Hunter? Monster Hunter? I don't know. Yeah! New map, baby. Let's go. Finally. Something. <laughs> the game's been dead for so long. It's been like four fucking months. Yeah, that's a new monster. Thank God. <laughs> oh... Thank you for the real content, Capcom. This better not be a DLC announcement for like six months from now. I'm going to screw. God fucking damn it. God fucking damn it. What did I just say? Summer 2020. No more content for you. <laughs> Go back to playing stories too. And I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. <laughs> so far out. What you just saw was the first trailer for Monster Hunter Rise. Uh, hold on. The massive expansion for eh. Monster Hunter Rise. Our friends at Capcom are working on many new elements that will enhance the experience for players of Monster Hunter Rise. We just turned on CC and it's not working. Locales, oh, there it is. Monsters. And, although not touched on in the trailer, new hunting actions... Oh my god, it's so delayed. Monster Hunter Rise. <laughs> Turning that off, that's worthless. It's scheduled to release as paid DLC in summer 2022. Please stay tuned for more information in the future. Wow, what an awful right. way. I mean, it's good. I'm glad it's coming. That's headline. so far away. And their game is so dead. <laughs> party during the day. Or oh, yeah, the Mario Party comes out. It's almost time to party in the Mario Party Super The crime game theme. simulator. Along with Spaceland and Peach's birthday cake, several other boards make their return. Take a stroll around Woody Woods. But watch out for those Monty Moles. They'll change the board's direction when you least expect it. Travel between two islands and Yoshi's Tropical Island. Toadette's got the star. Now these are, I assume these are from newer games, because I don't remember any of these. Party no, that one's actually old, I think. In Horror Land. That King Boo statue is harmless during the day, but at night, it'll swipe stars from unsuspecting players. Yeah, King Boo. Boards? Head to Mount Minigames and play in minigame only courses. Compete against players worldwide for the longest yeah, win don't... streak in survival. Oh, Work together Nintendo in the Online. Cooperative multiplayer tag match. Mount Minigames will have seven courses available. All boards and minigames support online play. So invite family, friends, and frenemies and get ready for the party of a lifetime. Woohoo! Mario Party Superstars launches on the Nintendo Next Switch month. system October 29th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. Spend your Halloween beating your friends to death. A new RPG is in the cards. Ooh. Welcome to Voice of Cards. What? Actually, wait, I think this might have been shown off before. There was a thing about a card game RPG a while back. But what what the fuck? There... Why does that look like Dragon Guard art? Queen's best. <laughs> You'll set off on a fantastic Is this Yo that card game Yoko Taro was working on? <laughs> and fortune. Everything in this <laughs> realm is represented as cards from the protagonists to shops, towns, environments. I was going to say, that's just, that's just the Drakengard art style. It's been a little while since I've seen it. In turn-based card battles, where your skills and a little bit of luck will determine the victor. Yeah, the music really hits, too, with it. A spellbinding experience from the creative minds of Yoko Taro. Yep. And yeah, okay. Saito is about to unfold. <laughs> little, little... 
That was just one. <laughs> that white haired girl on screen for a second. Dragon roars. Launches on yeah, the Isle Dragon Roars. Pre orders and a free demo will be available. That's today really soon. <laughs> <laughs> also, Shadow Drop the demo. Become a hero or an absolute disaster of a human being. Oh no. <laughs> you awaken in a hotel oh, this room is... in the city of Revishal. <laughs> this looks a little rough on Switch. <laughs> Soon, you learn that you're a detective and get entangled in a strange murder case in the groundbreaking role-playing adventure, Disco Elysium, The Final Cut. Now with voice As acting, you so you don't have to kill yourself to play it. Clues, internal dialogues will begin. To investigate, you'll need the help of the 24 skills living within you. Go become a crazy cryptid man and just listen to a dude yell about cryptids for four hours. You develop these skills, <laughs> directly impacting how the story progresses. What sort of detective will you become? Disco Elysium. Yeah, no, this was like a, ga a game of the year contender, like 10 out of 10 from like two years ago, I think. I can't, I, has it been that long, actually? For the digital version begin today on it's been a little while. Long enough that they re-released the entire game with... Oh, yeah, this, this happened. This game still runs at 15 frames a second. What am I? That's being generous. <laughs> Ugh. Rip egg. <laughs> oh, hey, Sidon. And about that courageous friend of yours, it seems I owe him as well. Yeah. The king of Hyrule must not fall. You know, you're pretty good for a little kid. We'd better partner up on this, don't you think? Ooh. Oh yeah, Banana Man. No, egg. Okay. I was going to say, but what's in it though? Uh, so the scientists are playable. <laughs> oh, yeah. Added character, battle test the guardian. Ready, set, chocobo. Mm, oh, whatever. Start I ain't paying attention to that game. For a new racing what? Is this just Mario Kart with chocobos? Like chocobo and Gilgamesh to be the oh my god. <laughs> It's fucking like Final Fantasy. By using drip to cut Mario cards. Kart. <laughs> magical stones called magicites are contained inside items. Collect <laughs> these throughout courses to cast magic like fire and arrow to blast away opponents. God, be kidding Require me. Magicites of the same element to cast even more powerful spells. Oh god, fire oh god. <laughs> It's just a blue shell. A special ability. Use it at the right time to turn the tables. Oh my god, get <laughs> Engine customization <laughs> options will be available, as well as local and online multiplayer. This looks rad, actually. Yeah, Ramu. <laughs> Up to 64 players can compete in a bracket-style tournament to determine the racing champion. Chocobo GP races exclusively <laughs> that onto looks Nintendo rad. Switch next year. <laughs> what did you think? I think Before they made a cooler Mario Kart video. than you. <laughs> We have some news about the last fighter for the Super Smash Brothers Ultimate Game. Uh-oh. Mr. Sakurai, the game director, will reveal this fighter in the final Mr. Sakurai Presents Get fucked. on October 5th. <laughs> it's not here. <laughs> I win. He'll also show you how to use this fighter, so please look forward to it. It's been about three years since the game was released. This will be the last presentation about Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. I hope you'll check it out. That's not even a week from now. That's that's almost two now, weeks from now. <laughs> take a look at this. Hey. What's up? Doc? Oh, is this Splat? 
This has splat vibes. Okay, so this is the thing that leaked with Curb. <laughs> I tried not to pay any attention to the image, though. Yeah, Curb! Oh, 3D Curvy. It feels weird. Bum, bum, ba, 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 ba. Bum, ba, da, 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 da. <laughs> Go! <laughs> this, this is a weird, weird tone they're setting here. <laughs> oh, don't like that. <laughs> stuck on the spikes. <laughs> Yo, gorilla, monkey. God, big budget 3D Kirby is not 3D platformer Kirby. Is it? That's a Okay. <laughs> Spring. They said this was for games in winter, but they lied. That was the trailer for Kirby and the Forgotten Land. Kirby is just good vibes. You don't need in to be super game, into Kirby. It's just good vibes. Look at them. Familiar Kirby moves. <laughs> The setting also appears to be <laughs> mysterious, filled with abandoned structures from a past civilization. What lies in store for Kirby? They just noticed the big eyes the he had when he got grabbed. Released in spring 2022. We hope you'll look forward to Don't Kirby's be silly. Adventure. Every Kirby game ends with a horrible eldritch monstrosities. Next, we have this to show you. Please take a look. Oh, you're doing pretty good so far. Oh, are we getting an actual big update again? The Roost. I hope it's open 24-7. It's in the museum. Wait, is that Blathers? Not Blathers. Um, Brewster. <laughs> the thing. Yeah, yeah, okay. Come back to come back <laughs> next month. Since its launch in 2020, the Animal Crossing New Horizons <laughs> game has been enjoyed by many players around the world. New free yeah, there he is. Arrive in November. In preparation it's for been a release, long time since they've like updated Animal something. Crossing New Horizons Direct in October. In it, we'll go over the content in more detail. It's it's an unfortunate game because it's really good, but the then you for the hit the of this credits and there's not much really to do at all. Let's move on to more and the events kind of killed the game because they sucked. <laughs> Two games, one game update, and lots of fun. Hmm. Four. Oh. More free content okay. is coming to the Mario Golf Super Rush game. I'll be real, we didn't get this game because it looked like this was going to be a game you play for like two hours with friends and then that's it. <laughs> this game did not seem like it had a lot of modern day uh, substance that would be able to hold it over. Even though it looked really cute for a golf game. These additions will come swinging in as a free software update later today. Yeah, pretty much. Like, What's what? This? An invitation. This is a Disney Parks You're game again? To yeah. Live in a magical world with Mickey Mouse and dozens of Disney characters. 
Yo, Lilo's there. That part's gonna be cut out on the Japanese trailer. <laughs> Only Stitch will be there. Oh, don't put a me next to Pooh. Oh god, the character models. version is included. Disney Magical World 2 Enchanted Edition soars onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. A beloved oh. Star Wars game is it's... coming to Nintendo Switch. <laughs> really? Blast off to captivate <laughs> Kotor original with Jedi. Droids right after you announce the remake for everything else, huh? Role playing and adventure. <laughs> will you use the Force for good? I mean, that's portable Kotor. Your choices determine the galaxy's fate in Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic, launching on Nintendo Switch it's November. Very funny. So they just just announced the remake. Shop. She was in the JP trailer. Okay. <laughs> There's one thing you must always remember: stay human. This is the city, what? humanity's last stronghold against a virus that turns people into the undead. Oh, the zombie game. Version, of dying like you you'll need to master both parkour and tactical combat to survive in this brutal open dying light too but playing through the cloud on the switch online co-op good luck dark secrets of those in power <laughs> during the day then plunder the layers of the infected at night your decisions will shape the story but they'll also have consequences this no is gonna where your actions this is, lead you this is not gonna run well you must always remember Stay or look open. well <laughs> while you're at it take the prequel on the go in dying light platinum edition scavenge for supplies craft weapons and face these visuals the are all lies post-apocalyptic <laughs> it, it won't look like this dying light don't two, fall for human. it cloud version launches on nintendo switch february 4th 2022 <laughs> a free demo will also launch the same day on nintendo eShop. the cloud dying light platinum edition comes to nintendo switch october 19th Happy by day of Nintendo visibility, Wii everyone. Anyway. <laughs> Utility, morality. Oh, is this liberty. triangle, whatever? In triangle yeah. strategy, <laughs> a fiery chronicle of war presented in stunning HD 2D. My apologies. Your My apologies. Lead you through a riveting story that changes based on the decisions you make. In the end, where will your conviction guide you? You have gone to the one place I cannot follow. In response That's not to the what the text said. The demo released in February of this year. The game has been fine-tuned with a focus on elements that received lots of feedback. Are you going to do another demo? These include adjustments to the difficulty, improvements to on-screen visuals, camera angle controls, the ability to review previous dialogue. Wait, you mean none of that was in it? <laughs> and streamlined game flow and loading times. More details are now available on Nintendo.com. Roar! Triangle Strategy will launch on Nintendo Switch March 4th, 2022. Pre-orders begin today. Oh, on yeah, Nintendo no new demo. Shop. This is... You got your one demo. We made adjustments. <laughs> oh, here's Dread. Look away for spoilers if you care, I guess. Because they're probably going to show some shit again. They probably shouldn't. <laughs> Should be simply to survive. Yeah, this is all from the original, original bit of gameplay we saw. There may be a very small opportunity to escape. Don't let your guard down. Oh, yeah, that's new. Yeah, yeah, they showed that one earlier. I was like, why would you show that? <laughs> Don't worry, chat, I'll say. Yep, there's that other thing they should not have shown in advance. <laughs> Samus Aran. The most powerful bounty hunter in the galaxy embarks on a new mission to the uncharted planet. Wait, it's still going? Okay. The objectives: confirm whether the deadly X parasite still exists, and figure out why the Emmy. What do you mean we're still dealing with that? Have mysteriously gone dark. 
Early readings reveal that planet ZDR is oh, they're doing a big showcase, huh? Each with its own elements. Ooh, ooh. Jason's gonna hate that. <laughs> Remnants of the mighty Chozo civilization are also scattered throughout, including evidence that the Chozo may have once called the planet their home. Visit metroid.nintendo.com <laughs> to read Metroid Dread Report Volume 8 for a detailed account of the terrain and life forms. Okay, I wasn't expecting a go to metroid.nintendo.com. Be sure to view the other Metroid Dread reports there as well. You'll want to prepare yourself for the dangers that lie There goes, there goes the fucking aversion. Metroid Show a picture of the website. It's done. <laughs> Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo. You, you can, you can turn, you can look at the sound again. How was that? Up next, we have news about Nintendo Switch Online. Uh oh. Many people have been using Nintendo Switch Online since it launched in September 2018. Yeah, it sucks. In addition to the current membership, we'll be adding a new membership plan. As a part of this new plan's content. <laughs> hey guys, it's that game that we should have put on the store ages ago for you. But instead, we're making them new content that you have to make a new subscription plan for. The Nintendo 64 system launched 25 years ago. <laughs> Fuck you. I think the system gave many players. These all should have been on been on the fucking thing as well as like a year ago. Multiplayer action. There's With no Nintendo excuse. Switch, up to four people can play select Nintendo 64 games locally or online. Oh, it has online multiplayer too. Fuck also, off. with this new membership plan, in addition to the Nintendo 64 games, Sega! what do you, you mean? Can play a collection of games you're Sega you're Genesis finally system. giving us Genesis games and and 64 so games, but they need a new online membership. And wherever you'd like. The new plan will include all elements of the base Nintendo Switch online uh, membership. Mm, mm, mm. As well as the ability oh, to play the included it. Nintendo 64 and Genesis games. This is Nintendo Switch Online plus expansion. That that ain't it. That ain't it, Nintendo. You this fucked that up. That should have be just been late October. That should just been in the base a of long course, time ago. Still be able to continue using the existing plans. Also, those who have an existing membership plan can change over to the new plan. Yeah, but how much more, more is it? About this new membership plan at a later Cause you're gonna need to offer more. The exact release date and pricing information. Oh, so you, you now, just don't have anything. We'd like to announce the games that will be available when it launches. 64, Mario Kart, Star Fox 64, Yoshi Story, Zelda, Winback. Oh god, that's a lot of Genesis games. Echo the Dolphin! <laughs> we'll also continue adding more Nintendo 64 games. Oh, such and as then the they're going to add Majora's Mask. Majora's Mask and F0, F-Zero? As well as other Nintendo 64 and Genesis games. Snap! Going Original! Forward. Fuck you! <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> Kirby 64, Paper Mario, Banjo-Kazooie 2? We prepared Nintendo 64 and Genesis <laughs> controllers to Fuck ensure the games can be played with the same style Those should have all been on the store ages ago. Those should have all been part of the fucking online console. Oh my god. Can be used wirelessly. <laughs> These controllers will be available for purchase by any Nintendo Switch. Oh my god. Online. No, do none of y'all better not buy the Nintendo 64 controller for $50 or I'll get you. That controller is awful. <laughs> Nintendo Switch Online plus expansion pack. <laughs> Let's see a few more Nintendo Switch headlines. Okay, you're gonna need to make up for this now. There's plenty to play to make in up these for this. Cyberpunk meets fantasy in this three-game collection of cult classic RPGs. As a Shadowrunner mercenary, you'll explore a dystopian future where magic has reawakened and fantasy creatures have come back to life. Immersive branching narratives, skill-based character growth, and gripping turn-based tactical combat await in Shadowrun Trilogy. Shadowrun Trilogy. Next year. Well, much to say about that. Look at me. struggle against <laughs> Count Dracula continues. Castlevania ah, Advanced ah, Collection ah, ah, ah. brings together four classic Castlevania games with deathly yeah. beautiful graphics and hauntingly Here he comes. Music. The Rewind, 
quick save and button mapping features will also vamp oh hell yeah cheat features baby yeah death but he's a poke game <laughs> as well as a gallery mode with never before Ooh. seen artwork are included all right Castlevania that's worth it advanced collection launches on nintendo switch later today later today and rad classic <laughs> returns How much is that? Whoa, hold up. The classic Super NES game Act Razor returns on Nintendo Switch. <laughs> now remastered in HD. Remastered. As the Lord of Light and Almighty God. Yo. Only you can save mankind from the forces of Tanzra, the Lord of Dark. You'll wage war in two phases. First, strike down monsters in the side scrolling action phase to liberate the lands from First, the Castlevania. Of Master swordsmanship and magic to vanquish all who stand in your path. <laughs> then, cultivate the lands you've liberated in the world building creation phase. Okay, that's cute. It's up to you to decide which structures will be destroyed to make way for new ones, creating a flourishing <laughs> civilization. As you do so, your powers will increase, giving you an. Uh, who remembered? Uh, probably like. Alternate between the original. Five people on my Twitter who's gonna be like, oh, and enjoy I played this music. when I was in college. New stages on an emulator. And, new boss also await. <laughs> and that does look rad. Admittedly. Switch later today. <laughs> A new chapter is about what? to unfold. Uh, uh, I gotta go. Uh. Alright, it's just the chapter two one. Oh yeah, I can't look at this, but you guys have fun. I gotta close my eyes till it's over. <laughs> Thank you, Toby. You're great. I just can't look at it yet. Oh wow, look at that. That's cool. Yeah. Funny dog. Alright, so they really just put SMT5 in a sizzle reel? The game comes out in two months. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's fucking SMT5. It's just in the sizzle reel. <laughs> There's still like 10 minutes left on this. Come on. <laughs> Yo, Pac Man. No, it's my room fat three. <laughs> How's everything? There are still Okay, so what's your big announcement then? Nintendo Direct. Koizumi-san. Oh, Miyamoto-san. Oh no, it's what Miyamoto. I wanted to make an announcement, so I was hoping I could step in. Oh, of course. Yeah, it's really funny that SMT was in that real wit. Like, get <laughs> Miyamoto. Fucking nothing. We previously announced that I have been working with the Hollywood movie studio Illumination and its CEO and producer oh, no. Chris Miller. Is it the Mario movie? Who are known for movies like Despicable Me <laughs> and Sing in making a full-length animated Mario movie. We might have to mute this. Today, I wanted to announce its theatrical release timing. Ta-da! In theaters next year. The Miyamoto sure does love to come on scene to go, here's a picture. Goodbye. The release date for North America is on December 21st, <laughs> and we'll be announcing release dates for Japan, Europe, and other regions at a later timing. It'll be a while longer until we can share a glimpse of Mario in action on the big screen. But today, I also wanted to reveal our key cast members who will be voicing Mario and his friends in the movie. Should just be who he always is. First, what? Of course, is Mario. What the fuck? By Chris Pratt. What the He's fuck? So cool. Mario will be talking a lot in the movie. Mario he shouldn't be talking Mario at all. <laughs> by the very talented he should Chris go Mamma Mia and then he should step on the Bowser. <laughs> Next, Princess Peach will be played by Anya Taylor-Joy. I can't wait to see a very spirited Princess Peach. I want you to know I can see I can see the YouTube chat in the corner. It's just people going white and yelling no. Played by Charlie Day. 
I'm excited for you to see this timid sibling appear on screen. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're like, yo, that's fair. I like that one. <laughs> that one's funny. <laughs> Comedian Keegan Michael Key. What do you mean, Michael Keegan? I'm looking forward to toad. great comedic moments. <laughs> Even though this is a Mario movie, what? Donkey Kong will also be making an appearance. Seth Rogen, Donkey Kong. What the Seth fuck Rogen. is happening? I'm eager for you to see a humorous Donkey Kong. What do we? Son. What universe did we clip into? And of course, Charles Martinet, who has voiced Mario and many more Nintendo yeah, characters so why isn't in our he games Mario? over the years, is also involved. But why isn't he Mario though? Surprise cameos in the movie. Oh, he's Stan Lee. He's Stan Lee. That's what. We also have more incredible talent <laughs> in the film to play some of our other beloved characters. And Spike. <laughs> that is all I can share with you today about the Mario movie. This is a very collaborative project Mario Chris and Pratt. Nintendo. We've all been coming up with all sorts of ideas. What? And I myself am enjoying a creative process that is a little bit different from making I... games. I, I, there's a lot of money going into that, but zero hope. Back to you. Please look forward to the look on his face. Into the world of motion pictures. Next, we'd like to show you this. The Jack Black is Bowser one is rad. I'll give him that. That's a, that's a fun pick. Hey, here we go. Here's Splat. Bum, 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 bum. Little crab bot. It's a droidica, <laughs> but a crab. <laughs> Ninja. Time. Oh god, it's got hair. Yeah, here's your here's your fire campaign. Whoa, what the fuck? Gridman? What are you doing here? <laughs> yeah, they have a story mode. They had an entire story DLC. Two. Bump, bump. Oh, those outfits are cute. Bump, 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 bump. <laughs> Mecca. <laughs> Splatoon 3. Space? Hold on, what? <laughs> <laughs> uh Return of the Mammalians? Uh oh. <laughs> Hello everyone. I'm a researcher from the Squid Research Lab. I've been meticulously studying the mysterious squids that can transform into humanoid form. What you just saw was the latest research footage from Splatoon 3. Allow me to share a bit of what we know so far. Become monkey. Splatoon 3 takes place in Splatsville. <laughs> it's known as the city of chaos. That's Center not the name I would expect. Splatsville are the Splatlands, a place long inhabited the by lands, sea uh, creatures lands. Oh such as God. squids and octopuses. Buildings spanning several yeah, generations are crammed into the city. <laughs> Creating its distinctive culture. In the Splatlands, Turf War appears to be in typical a fashion activity. in a post apocalyptic universe. Basic France always gets blown up. <laughs> Two four player teams <laughs> compete against each other to ink the most area. Yes, that's what tune. The trend seems to have undergone a major shift with the Crap. existence of new main and special weapons confirmed. I don't like that footage. ninja goo outfit. In portion of the footage, we were able to observe activities from story mode, the single player campaign. 
return of the mammalians. <laughs> Meaning the reappearance of mammals appears to be the theme of story mode this time around. What could this possibly mean in a world where all mammals, except for two cats, have vanished? Except for the cats! It appears that there's still a lot to uncover. I like how we'll Callie and Marie have a new girl hanging out with them. Keep you updated <laughs> once more results become available. Please look forward to more. That game's gonna end with you going to space. <laughs> Updates to come. Pearl and Marnie might be back because usually time. there's the story and then there's like the main hub stuff, which is what so, I think they did in game two. What did you think? Since the DLC was about Splatoon Pearl and Marnie. 3, taking place in a new world, is Marine. scheduled to release in 2022. Please look forward to future updates. Okay. Anything else? This is the last trailer we have to okay. show you today. Please take a look. I don't think they've shown anything mature yet. <gasps> what the fuck? Hold on. Hold on. What the fuck? What the fuck? HQ, set the kisha. Yori, go on. I show up. Octoni, look at the What the fuck? What? That's not gonna work. Mm. Oh, that's horrible. Nah, Demon X Machina didn't have anything like this. It also took place on, like, Mars. I'm this voice and music are sounding a little familiar, but I don't want to say it! I don't want to say it! I don't want to say it! Oh my god, it's not that! That's even funnier! What do you mean this shit's back? No, that is witch time! That is witch time! Yeah! <laughs> Finally! That fucking... I can't believe they put the dog from that fucking shit there! <laughs> in my pants! It seems I'm unbelievably late. No, that's why I started freaking out immediately because I'm like that the design of that city the way they're coloring stuff looks familiar <laughs> It's based off of uh, Cereza's outfit from one where she has the pigtails <laughs> That was yes, that was the dog from astral chain. That's why I had that what the fuck moment Yo, she's got a real ass devil trigger now Are you actually controlling it? <laughs> You're actually controlling him, it looks like now. Fuck yeah. Oh, that's cool. That's a callback for the two. Oh, it's actually real. <laughs> 20 next year. What? What? Who? 
<laughs> not Virgil, not Dante. What, what the fuck you was just that? Saw was the latest trailer for Bayonetta three? We announced this game in 2017. <gasps> Look at that. That was totally just off-brand Virgil. <laughs> next year. We hope you look forward to Bayonetta's new encounters. I think that's the hardest I've ever popped up. <laughs> that's all for today's Nintendo Direct. He changed Virgil from watching. Devil May Cry. I, I really wanted to have hope when it said up to mature on this stream, but I... <laughs> Let's let's uh, chat. One second. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> One second. There were there were so many haha we got used during that <laughs> trailer. <laughs> no, when I when I saw the um the shape of the city, my brain was immediately like, oh it's the the way stuff's modeled looks like ban looks like ba the one from Bayo 2. Oh. Oh. <laughs> the fucking dog from Astral Chain. From the Daily State of Bayonetta 3, day 1,386, oh my jubileus. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. We're gonna, we're gonna look at this trailer again. <laughs> One second, chat. We gotta, we gotta look at this one again. We gotta run this back. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I'm going over here. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. No, that's not it. There we go. All right. Here we go again, chat. Yeah, like, the way this was rendered and the jets flying over the city immediately made me, like, seize up thinking it was three. Finally. And then the soldiers come out and you're like, wait, what? <laughs> also, shout out to this one taking place in Japan now. And like, the designs were slightly off for the enemies, so I wasn't sure if it was it or something like entirely new. But then this music started playing. And if you listen closely to when they're swinging swords around, you can hear like angel talk. Like that. And then you get the purple shots and the platinum. And then it's just the fucking Lappy the Dog from Astral Chain. <laughs> that is the best fake out. It's that's so good. Yeah, no, this game totally got either like hard pushed back or had development issues and got scrapped at multiple points. Yeah, it's just a mix of her Bayo One outfit and Cereza. Her, that's her, that's her hair is when she was a little girl. All right, here we go. Verse seven. 
But I see your demons are on a trigger on the bottom left that you can't see, and you click the D-pad to choose between three of them. And they have a recharge, so once you've used them, they cross themselves out, it looks like. Yeah, her outfit is just her hair. You can even see it. The bow is all her hair but this time on the back of her dress. <laughs> hey, Gamora. He doesn't have a crown this time. I don't think. At least not that I can see. Yeah, yeah, you're totally just <laughs> doing kaiju battles. So there's a tiny bar on the bottom right. Uh, hold on, actually. So that I can show this to you better. One second. Eh, 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 eh. So, there's this tiny bar on the bottom right. It has three de summonable demons on it that it looks like in open areas you might be able to get at any time. Uh, and then it has a tiny bar on the bottom, and once you summon them, the bar starts building down. And there appears to be a input lineup on the bottom of the names. If you look underneath them, where you can see kick, punch, etc. So it looks like you queue up attacks. As the bar, as the bar goes down. There's also no magic gauge underneath your health bar, by the way, this time. So it looks like magic's been just fully transported into... Nah. Do the kaijus. <laughs> uh, no, they showed more than three. Like, hold on. I believe they showed more than three of them. There will be more than three, though. I think, like, in two, she had, like, seven or something. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've played that. One. Yeah, no, she has more than three. You can see different ones on the bottom, like the frogs down there. Or, or the bird, whatever. <laughs> yeah, there's the bird, the spider. Gamora. Ah, ah. God, that I hate that. <laughs> oh, it's got like a. Oh, it's got like the actual um. It's got the actual tail thing from when it was a boss in DMC. Now, if you remember that from the first game. When the when the back like unfolded. This is you know this is all like the first mission, right? <laughs> Hold on, we gotta get a look at this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Alright, so yep. Slick back hair. Spiked coat. Sword katana on the back. <laughs> it's just not Virgil. It's it's just not Virgil. <laughs> Switch, how are you gonna run this? Uh, probably the same way that it ran. Uh, two and three, two and one. Sorry, because those did get ported. Ha! <laughs> ah! Oh boy! <laughs> <laughs> gonna need uh, <laughs> need to get a highlight of that one up. <laughs> All right. We are going to, uh, that's not going to get a PC port, just like 2 didn't, because it's, it's going to be a thing that Nintendo has paid for. <laughs> We're going to switch, get set up for Scaredy Cat now. Scaredy Cat. Resident Evil 7 Finale. No funny quip for this one. Because I can't think of one. <laughs> R 
Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. Did you know that Twitch has a has a fucking thing for the for the beginning hour demo for the teaser it's for Resident Evil 7 as a category on here? Crazy. All right. We're